It's a Galaxy 500, but it's a Skyliner is the model with the retractable roof going into the trunk. It was around $1,200 option at the time. Uh, don't quote me to the penny, but in around that. Um, so if you bought the car and wanted that top to go in the trunk, it was that much more. That was a lot of money in 59, I think. When the Skyliner went out of production in 1959, it would take some 40 years for the hardtop convertible to be resurrected. And that was done by Mercedes-Benz with their SLK. In, uh, in the trunk area, um, it's a lot of, um, a lot of linkage and um, motors and cables to make the roof go into the trunk. There is one small area in the middle that's uh, safe to put luggage or whatever you don't want squeezed, I guess, by the roof. Uh, it's quite a large area. If you didn't have the roof in the trunk, you could put lots of stuff in it, but uh, that's the way they did it. It was they, just uh, so much roof, it fills it when it's in there. It's just a 59 Ford, really. Uh, they, were a, they were a good, dependable car and just a neat option on it, that's all. They made them from 57 till 59 only, so it's a pretty rare car and uh, they didn't make that many that year. It was 12,915, I looked it up, but uh, pretty pretty few made, really. So uh, anyway, when you, whenever you put that top down or up, people stop and look.